Ripley Sartain from Wisconsin Wonder Gardens wanted to show you basically we're on phase two of the project we got the boat cut out um, the next phase was finding a place for it and we figured we wanted it here there was a bunch of uh, I think it was buckthorn growing up in these bushes here and along with the bushes that they planted but they were just out of control so what we did was uh, tore them out of the ground and I'm gonna have to be uh, Pretty heavy on the trimming as far as down here goes and around the backside All this stuff See right there growing up. I'm gonna have to go under and clip that constantly so the plant doesn't come up again from under the boat. Obviously we wouldn't want that. So I took some of the rock that was here already and placed it under the boat so that it is solid right underneath. So it conforms to the shape of that hull. Um, what we're going to do is put some larger field rock here and smaller rocks around the front end to uh, to kind of make it look like it's up on a beach. Uh, fill in soil on that backside. Build up the edges a little bit and do the same thing back over here on this side. The boat is going to get painted. Um, Back over here, we're gonna have more perennials outside of the boat. So when you're looking from the street, you can see that foliage growing around the backside. And I think it's gonna look really nice like that. The middle bay, I figured out, I'm gonna use this for uh, planting some wetland plants. I was gonna do a pond, but I think I'll just do that. So plants that love the water, I'll put in that middle section and then grow other plants around the edge. I got a few suggestions already on plants to use for some ground cover and stuff. So thank you guys so much for that. If you would like to feel free to comment on what kind of plants you think should go in here, in the, in the bay there, the outside around the ground cover because that's what I'm really trying to get from you guys the viewers um, is your take on this because I want to treat this like a community event you know we're all out there working hard in our front and backyards to kind of restore them up to uh, a natural form so comment on a few nice perennials preferably native plants that I could use in this thing. Thank you guys so much for watching. Stay tuned. I will have a video up soon about all the progress we've been making in the backyard as well. Thanks guys, take care.